there and welcome to Linux Studio and in this video guide I'm gonna show you how you can install ZBrains IntelliJ IDE on Linux. So this guide is for all kind of Linux distribution. It doesn't matter which one you are using just follow along and you will be able to install it. So first of all what do you wanna do? You wanna open up the web browser and search for ZBrains IntelliJ. This should bring up the ZBrains official website. Simply click on the link and it will open up the website. Here click on the download and with the download button simply choose the addition that you want to install. I'm going with the community one but you are free to go with the ultimate if you want to install that one. First I'm going to click on the download button and uh, this should start to download the file. The file is going to be a tar file and it's around 700 megabyte so it can take some time. After downloading the file, simply extract it. So the extracted content of the file is here. So you can see this is the idea IC folder. So I'm going to rename it to the idea IC. So what do you want to do now? You just go to the bin folder and from here execute the idea as a file this one over here so right click and open the terminal if you're not seeing the open with the terminal option then simply change directory to idea ic so now let me show you the content of the folder so this is the file we need to execute simply type dot slash and idea sh simply hit the enter and this should open up the installation window now you can see you have to select the confirmation option over here to accept the privacy policy hit continue if you want to share the statistics then simply send anonymous statistics otherwise you can skip it and uh, this should show you this window over here simply choose the theme that you want light or dark I'm gonna select with the Dracula the dark theme you can see this is going to create a desktop entry so that you can simply execute it from the application menu by searching idea click next Again next, this will show some of the plugins that you can install in the system. These are the ones that are already there. You can disable them if you do not want them. Click next. You can install from here. Now simply start it. So here as you can see, this is the IntelliJ idea. Now you can simply start any of your project and start a coding. Now this is the easiest way that you can utilize to install IntelliJ IDEA but there are other ways also available. For example, you can also install it through a snap. So you can see on the snap store it's available. If your distribution has a snap support, simply execute this command and it will install the IntelliJ IDEA. If you do not have a snap support, then check out the below given guide. Simply click on any of these guides. For example, I want to install it on Fedora. Click on the Fedora, it will show how to set up a snap on Fedora. The application also available through Flathub. That means you can install it as a Flatpak application. So simply go to the flathub.org and search for idea. And uh, you can see the option is available. Simply use the installation command given over here and you shall be able to install the IDE in your distribution. Of course, for this you need to have the flatpak support in your distribution so check out the setup guide to install the support for the flatpak in your distribution so this is how you can install it in your distribution so that was it i hope you find this guide helpful if you did then leave a like to the video hit the subscribe and let me know what you think about it in the comment section below and i shall catch you in the next one till then take care and keep enjoying linux